I have um, a question for you. Does acupuncture help with fertility? I think it's a great tool for a lot of people. And if you feel like it helps you gain control of the process, um, if you feel like it relaxes you, I think it's very, very helpful. And there's, there's very little risk involved. If you feel like it stresses you out because there's more needles involved and it's another appointment and it's more money, then, then I would avoid it. It's my understanding that acupuncture offers um, some general relief of anxiety associated with yeah. the process, and I agree. Dr. Brower, do you have anything else to add um, as a sort of button-up point that would really be great yeah. information for our YouTube audience to hear? Yeah, I think I think the most important thing to know is there's always a way to make it happen if it's what you want, and you shouldn't give up on that. And Wherever you are in the process, whether you're 26 and just like thinking about having babies or you're 42 and, and, and are having this like epiphany of, oh my gosh, I want babies. It's always worth at least having a consult, right? It's so easy to do. Same with you guys and pelvic pain and endometriosis. We're all on telemedicine now. You can do it from the comfort of your own home. Um, and, and, you know, I think it's important just to kind of get that information and a plan is very anxiety relieving. So rather than, you know, kind of driving yourself crazy about it, talk to a doctor, develop a plan. It doesn't mean that you have to go into treatment tomorrow. Just develop a plan. And I think you'll feel like you have a lot more control over the situation. Dr. Davison. Um, I agree. If you're seeing us in the office, even for something unrelated, if fertility, even if you're 23, is on your mind, um, particularly if you have some sort of underlying um cycle irregularity or pain issue, or even if you're just a healthy, regular person and fertility is on your mind, it's never too soon to ask us about it. It sometimes feels like the elephant in the room, but we're more than happy to engage. And, um, you know, we have these newer technologies like egg freezing, which we'll talk about in depth another time, but there are, there's a lot more that we can do. And even if it's just a consultation, just that relieving, just having the conversation and initiating a consultation um, can reduce so much anxiety. It's really, uh, it's really worth it. Um, particularly, I'll just add that, you know, some of us who practice in big urban places or, um, you know, in New York City, uh, women are, are delaying pregnancies. And it's really relevant to have these conversations just to just to think about it, even um, if you're not even sure what your own answers are, but having the conversation and alleviating some of that anxiety is really worth it. So we're happy to have those those uh, conversations at any point.